YouTube, it's Yazzie, and today we are back with another video. Welcome back, subbies, and if you're new here, hello, friends. Today we're gonna be getting all glammed up for the new year. So whether you are keeping it low key this year, practicing social distancing, or you getting litty, either way you're gonna get litty, whether you're going out or you're staying in, you gotta get glammed up, and you gotta save up out of 2020, and you gotta ride up into 2021 in style, baby, so. <laughs> As always, remember to give this video a thumbs up, comment what you think, and also hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so that way you can see whenever I do new videos. I got a giveaway coming up as soon as I hit 50 subscribers, so spread the word. So without further ado, let's get to it. So you guys, this is going to be like literally a mini lookbook for the New Year's Eve celebration. So there's only going to be a few of these outfits and some of these outfits I got from Fashion Nova and some of these outfits I got from O21 to Shein. Same with the uh, pumps and the accessories. And I'm going to show you how I put them together. So the first outfit that I would like to showcase is going to be this dress right here. I know it's short and it looks like it's a shirt, but no, it's a dress. It's a mini uh, dress. <laughs> yes, so I brought out my Freakum dress, okay? It's the first one I'm gonna be showcasing. And this one I actually got from Fashion Nova and it's a small. And um, I love the fact that these this dress has a whole bunch of buttons down. Like it buttons all the way down and I just really love that because uh that's actually what attracted me to this dress because i love the style of a like fully buttoned down dress and i also love the fact that my shoulders are out so this is like sleeveless like the sleeves kind of <laughs> come like that so but yeah i mean the dress seems really short but i mean as you can see i have it on and it's not really short considering the fact that i'm a short person uh, but I decided to pair this dress with a, a clear black and gold bag that I, a transparent black and gold bag that I uh, got from Shein. And I'm also wearing um, these black pumps from Fashion Nova with a gold kind of accent accessory on the ends of the string. It's like a tie up heel, if you will. And this is like a really cute look. I think this would be really cute, like for if you're going out dancing or you know if you're going to like a cute rooftop like this is something that i know it's something that i would wear like if i was going to a lounge or a rooftop you know or just going out dancing or even going to dinner with my boo i mean this is something that i would put on you know and as for the pumps i really love the pumps um I'm not sure if you follow me on Instagram, but I also uh, wore these pumps in my birthday picture for when I turned 28. And uh, like, these are like my all time favorite pumps, like my go-tos, like these pumps, you can wear these with some jeans or you can wear it with a dress. Or even if I still wore skirts, like you can wear it with a skirt. Um, and as far as this bag, I've never really worn this bag, only but once. And I think I also wore that bag uh, in my birthday picture. Uh, so yeah, follow me on the gram, Yazzie underscore face 77, and you'll see what I'm talking about. So next, I'm going to be showcasing this jumpsuit. So um, I've only worn this jumpsuit once, and it was in 2018 when I actually went on a cruise, Captain's Night. This jumpsuit is so freaking elegant. It's so elegant, and it has like the cape-like shoulders slash sleeves. Or whatever as you can see and then it has like a, a really low v cut because i love v cups i like showing a little cleavage even though i barely have any but like i really 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 love v cut shirts like i just love it it's just something about it you know and this jumpsuit just screams elegance to me kind of adult sophisticated and um like normally i wear um i wear a nice necklace with this like a nice cute uh, elegant necklace with it or something gaudy but since I'm wearing my Kendra Scott's as you can see um, I don't really want to go over the top with the necklace when you know I'm going over the top with the earrings and then I chose to also uh, wear uh, a clutch with this the clutch I also got from Shein it's black and it has the gold trim 
and I think I actually uh, paired that. Matter of fact, this whole outfit uh, almost screams of, you know, Captain's Night. It's almost like a repeat of the cruise from Captain's Night, um, except I did have on a necklace that night and the earrings were different. Also, the pumps that I'm wearing with this, I love the fact that it's black and um, it's trimmed in gold. So this outfit just screams elegance to me, like a black and gold kind of feel. And honestly, that's really the theme colors for New Year's, you know, the black, the gold. So I feel like this this outfit really would be for like nice elegant party, like a hotel party of some sort, kind of black tie event, if you will. And as far as the shoes, I can't remember where I got the shoes from, but I'm pretty sure I got it from Fashion Nova. It seems like I get all my shoes from Fashion Nova, but we'll see. Everything you see in this video will be linked in the description, as well as the earrings, the necklaces, all that is gonna be linked, okay? The next outfit is this dress. Now, I got this dress from Fashion Nova, and um, I love, love, love it because of the sleeves. Like, this is so unique and different, the fact that <laughs> it's it's a cut off shoulder but then it has the sleeves like i really love that about this dress and i also like the way the front is made yeah i actually had this dress for a long time i, I think i got this dress in a small or extra small probably an extra small because back, back then i was a lot smaller but i actually had this dress a long time and i never thought i would be able to fit into it again but especially with quarantine because i gained a lot of weight you know during this whole quarantine thing but then i recently lost the weight i actually lost more than what i was supposed to lose so i'm that kind of thing so that's why i could fit into this but anyways um i had this just a long time and this is something that you can wear like out dancing or to the club you know and um i decided to pair it with some clear shoes um and also my clear bag i think it's a really cute fit it's very sexy you could also wear a necklace with this fit too but i chose not to i feel like if you're gonna wear a necklace with this and you don't want it to take away from your earrings i feel like you should um uh, just wear like a thin necklace something not too you know eye-catching <laughs> you know just a plain simple necklace um and I, I decided to pair it with um, this clear and gold bag as well because it goes with the clear shoes. So simple, simple outfit. The next outfit that I'll be showcasing is this white dress. Now I know what you're thinking, white and New Year's. Yeah, it can go together. People have all white parties. Now I've never been to one, but people have all white parties. Um, but the only thing about this dress that I would say I don't like is the fact that it's kind of see-through. Like I know at the top it kind of has an extra layer, but at the bottom it doesn't really have a layer. So it can be kind of see-through. So if I were to wear this out, I would make sure I have something white under it, like maybe a white bodysuit or something. But I love the back. I love the fact that uh, how the back is made with a gold accent in the back. And I, I also would rock this uh, dress with some clear uh heels as well and then the clear and gold accessory bag and um i would definitely rock a necklace with this i just feel like you have to have a necklace on with this since it's white and then it's kind of thin and it, it's almost a dress that you can dress up or dress now so i feel like you if you want to dress this dress up you definitely need the right accessories to be paired with this um and this dress screams brunch to me too. Like, you know, the fact that you can dress it up or down. And I got this dress from Rue 21 a long time ago. And it, of course, I got this in a small. The only thing I don't like about white is the fact that I'm always afraid I'm gonna get it stained or I'm gonna get foundation on it when trying to put it on or take it off. Like, ugh. I love the way white looks when I wear it. Uh, white jeans, white shirts, white dresses, but I just get so afraid that I'm gonna stain it and then I always end up staining it. Especially when I'm trying hard not to, that's when I stain it. Like it is so frustrating. I freaking hate it. <laughs> but anyways, back to this. So, and last but not least, the outfit that I'm still gonna be putting together is this cocktail dress. I love the fact that it's asymmetrical in one sleeve. And this is a dress that I got as a gift. Um, it is a four and I'm not sure exactly where it was from. It could have been from Dillard's, could have been from JCPenney's. Um, I'm not really sure, but this is a really good quality dress and it was expensive, but it was on sale, okay? 
I know for a fact that it was an expensive, an expensive gift, but it was on sale. And um, this is something that, this is like a, a little black dress you'll wear to like, you know, a cocktail event, a black tie event. And I decided to pair this dress with some cute shoes, some cute pumps uh, from Fashion Nova. And I also decided to go ahead and rock my, my clutch with it as well. And then uh, I decided to leave on the necklace that you uh, saw me previously with, with another dress, because it went well with this dress or whatever. And of course, you don't want to do too much with the earrings either. Now, um, if I were to leave the necklace off and do a lot with the earrings, then I would recommend putting on a necklace that's just low key or not a necklace at all. And I would also prefer to wear my hair up with this dress if I were to wear this out somewhere. I feel like this is like an updo dress. <laughs> but that's my opinion. But let me know what y'all think in the comments. Um, but yeah, I really love this look. It's very classy. It's very elegant. Just very adult-like. You know, sophisticated. And, you know, this is a look for that Hotel Derek party. Hotel Zaza party. That rooftop, you know, where you just have having that black tie event. This freaking screams elegant, okay? So that's what type of uh, fit that this is. That really concludes all the fits. Let me know uh, y'all's favorite in the comments and also let me know what y'all plans are for New Year's Eve because 2020 has been a year and I know everybody wants to be safe. Everybody wants to keep it cute and social distance and be safe, especially since there's so much going on. There's been so many people that's lost loved ones. There's some people that didn't make it in 2020. There's some people that won't make it into 2021. So just be really blessed that you're still here and be blessed that you're still healthy, still here to celebrate. I don't care how you celebrate, just celebrate. Just be happy. Do what makes you happy. Be thankful. You know, be grateful. And not only that, get done up. Get cute. <laughs> you know, because when you look good, you feel good, boo. All right, y'all. So this concludes our video. I really hope you enjoyed these looks. Remember to comment down below your favorite look. And remember that all of these outfits these looks these accessories down to the pumps are going to be linked in the description box below remember to stay tuned for the videos coming up because you don't want to miss the details of the giveaway that'll be coming up really soon and if i do not see you all before the new year happy new year y'all bye 2020 <laughs>